Some people may find big dogs overwhelming due to their large size. However, dog breeds make perfect family pets and are enjoyable to watch. They can terrify, charm with their cuteness, or defend from wild nature. But most of them act like babies. Please give me space. Fine. From giant breeds like the Great Dane and English Mastiff to lesser known breeds like the Tibetan Beast and the Bully Kutta, we'll show you the size, strength, and power of these magnificent animals. From heartwarming moments to comical blunders, this video will have something for everyone. So sit back, relax, and enjoy the show. Number one, is it fair that dogs get the hottest girls? The formula for success is quite simple. Be huge and cute simultaneously. Man, I wish I could be this dog for a moment. Sitting on the lap of a gorgeous girl and getting scratches? What else do you need for happy living? A big bone to bite. Number two, this is me every day when my parents drop me from middle school, high school, university, every year, any time of the season. Don't laugh, even big boys and girls want to be carried on hands. If carrying dogs was a job, how much would you pay to do it? Number three, perfect explanation of why you should never give up. Another big boy who needs some effort to make a perfect jump, but he kept trying and succeeded. The sky is the limit. Go hard or go home. Number four, that's the most badass fella in the hood. All because he got high connections. Just look at his squad. They can tear apart any wannabe gang out there. Crips and Bloods, you better hide. There are new players in town. Number five, is this a dog or a polar bear? Hard to tell. What I know for sure, this boy overeats the whole family, but that's okay. These eyes will make anyone work extra hours for the heavy bag of treats. And you can save up on heating. Sleep on this furry little guy. He won't mind. Number six. I don't know what made this guy so angry, but it should be the size of a bear, at a bare minimum. No way something smaller could get his attention. Although he looks terrifying, I can say by the look in his eye that he's a decent, family-loving guy and your kids would be safe with him. Number seven. These guys have ordered one hamburger and a double-sized Happy Meal with extra potatoes and a large soda. Can you guess who'll eat what? That's right, big boys eat big. Big smoke ordering food moment. Number eight. If this guy comes to me in real life and says, woof, I'll give him everything. My wallet, telephone, keys but he'll leave disappointed because all he wanted was hugs and treats. Don't be scared, this baby is a pup, just a bit bigger than your everyday one. Number nine, what a cute looking baby. How can something so adorable become a huge furious bulk of wildness in the blink of an eye? These kids grow so fast, still charming though, no matter the age. Number 10, forget all the big boys you've seen before. Now that is what I call certified hood big boy classic twice the size of a girl sitting next to it. If it sits on your lap, you'll never stand up, ever. Better hop on it and roll to your high school, become a local legend. Number 11. Imagine this furry fella living in a hot place like Spain or Portugal. Man, I hope he lives somewhere with a whole year's snow. He looks like Santa Claus's best friend material. Deers feel uncomfortable next to him. <laughs> Number 12. Everyone loves getting butt scratches. This guy missed his barber appointment a few times because he loses a chunk of fur after every scratch. I can only wonder how he kept his coat so snowy white. No secret here, love and a delicious bowl of goodies. Number 13. He's cute and he is huge, but he's a big talker too. If you're foolish enough to debate with him, prepare your arguments because he'll destroy you. Not with brutal force, but with charm and cuteness. Number 14. If your perfect date doesn't look like this, don't even bother calling me. If you're not a big chalk of white coat and love, then you're not my type. Swipe left. Number 15. Are these pumas or tigers? Nah, just your regular size good boys. Look terrifying, but behave good enough. Just a bit playful, but why not enjoy life while you can? 
Hope you're smart enough not to play UFC with them. Number 16. This guy's not a fan of long talks, but he's a big fan of hugs and kisses. If you're looking for a partner, search for someone who will look at you like this big boy looks at his owner. This is real love, not the one on love is cards. Number 17. So funny, this guy barks like perfect guard material but still whines like a baby. Probably his owner left him for a minute. Lesson learned, keep your loved ones close, especially if they're babies in adult pants. So hard to be a dog owner because you can never leave it alone. Number 18. This is the reason why slow-mo was invented in the first place. This good boy is so big that we need a minute to grasp his marvelous appearance as a whole. Number 19. What's the downside of owning a good big boy? No downsides, of course, but you can get in debt buying him food or drown in the lake of his drool. Get a big bowl and a big towel. Number 20. What a cheeky little bird, sitting on a nose of such a beast. What will it do? Devour the private space intruder? Beat it up? Nah, just kidding. They're besties. Good boys don't eat their homies. Sorry, birdie. All treats were successfully eaten. Number 21. Hey, yo, wannabe rappers watching this video, if you're swagging with a huge gold chain, you must look like these guys. Nothing less. Don't let your looks overrun your persona. These guys will look cool even without chains. That should be your role model. Number 22. What a silly big boy, you might think. Man, I wish I could be a big boy that still fits in a washing machine. My current thoughts. Warning. If you're someone's stepsister, don't try this trick at home. They always get stuck in those things for some reason. Number 23. Hey, look, that's Mr. Fluffy Fluffingston enjoying breakfast with his favorite human. Hugs go first and food goes second. No wonder he got a master's degree in Good Boys Academy. Number 24. What can big dog breeds do? They jump like Jordan, fight like Tyson, and eat like it's their last meal. This guy already jumped and ate, so you better run. Number 25. A regular day at an LA beach. Huge guy flexing his muscles and enjoying the sunshine. He got all it takes to crush girls' hearts. If you plan a double date, never take him with you. Number 26. Three good boys waiting for daddy to come home from work. Now that's what I call a perfect family. Hope daddy got treats for all three of them, or else, where the heck have you been? Number 27. This guy looks magnificent. So dark that you can see his skin devour all the light. The black hole should be his name because he sucked in my heart in seconds. Number 28. This big boy is angry. There's another big boy in the room making them fight for the title the best boy in the house. Don't get your fangs out. You can win this contest only with a cute face and gentlemanly behavior. Number 29. Here's video proof that all doggies are mere pups. None of them fully grow. They remain cute babies stuck in the bulk of their muscles. Who cares if they steal our hearts anyways? Number 30. Look at this adorable baby. Oops, my apologies, mister. Was a baby. I didn't see that coming. Kids grow fast and doggies grow seven times faster. By the way, is that the Texas map on his chest? Number 31. Oh yeah, he's walking, he's running, dancing, playing with a tiger, simply enjoying life at its finest. Owners trying to control these beasts always amuse me. It's him walking you, not vice versa. Number 32. Who's the biggest big boy in town? Dobermans probably consider themselves the biggest and scariest, but there's nothing they can do with the brutal force of alibi. Peace, boys. No need for conflict. Everyone gets their treats today. Number 33. Every street walk with this fella is a challenge. What if the doggy sees a squirrel and chases it? Will the guy release the leash or will the doggy drag him? It's one of two. Number 34. 
exquisite good boy now in 4K. Let's admire his gracious posture in slow-mo. Better than Avatar 2 if you ask my humble opinion. Number 35. Can't say for sure if it's a big boy or a big girl, but they love kisses and cuddles. Well, who doesn't? I heard big dogs require twice as many kisses as regular ones and 10 times more food. Number 36. This doggy can fool some of us with its silly little barks, but I know it can jump over the fence with little effort. It's hard to behave as a regular creature while being a Superman, but this baby gives its best. Wait for night to come and someone light up the Batman signal in the sky. Number 37. This guy is marvelous. Came right from the Lion King movie. Who said only lions can be kings? The beauty of this creature's fur says the opposite. Simba called, he wants his beard back. Number 38. It's hard to keep something away from a dog twice your size, but this girl does her best, only for us to admire the beauty of this marble white horse-sized dog. Number 39. Man, if you see those eyes glooming in the dark, pray it's only crickets. They would make any Night Stalker a God Believer. Okay, okay, don't worry so much, it's just a light play. I'm almost 100% sure he won't eat your soul. Number 40. This Doberman is built differently. It's drastically huge, twice the size of a regular one. This means his heart is twice as big too. We can clearly see it by his cute face. He loves Huggies like it's the most delicious treat. How long can you stay there for? Are you drooling? Do you want that bitch? I bet you do. Number 41. The perfect image for the Distant Relatives album cover. Brother from another mother. No matter who your mother was, look cute and behave so you can join the good boys club. Number 42. They say dogs start to look like their owners after some time. Judging by this video, this is 100% true. Wonder if they both love treats and butt scratches. Number 43. Some hate big dog breeds and want to ban them. Others make them part of their big families and let them play with their small kids. Remember guys, it's all about treatment. Teach your doggy how to behave or else even a chihuahua will cause you severe problems. Number 44. This kid could ride the doggy like a horse, but it's not for a ride. Look at these muscles. Perfect choice for a bouncer in a nightclub or an American football player. Definitely gets all the ladies in college. Number 45. Sorry, little fella. You'll need years of growing to become big enough and hide toys from this doggy. I bet this one can even jump on that wardrobe on the left. That's their job. Be big and sneaky at the same time. Number 46. Being big doesn't give you any privilege. If you want treats, you must behave like a gentleman. These guys learned their lesson by heart and never left the kitchen in hunger. Give paw and get food. Why doesn't the world work so easy for regular people? Number 47. Sorry for the clumsy moves. This boy definitely didn't want to hurt you, fella. He's so big that giving you scratches without tearing off half of your face is hard. But he's learning slowly. A few more injuries and he'll learn. Number 48. This doggy is not allowed on the couch, so he sits next to it, or he stays next to it. Hard to see the difference. Well, at least he tries to follow some rules. Still a good boy. If you ask me, getting a dog and not allowing it on a couch is a psychopath's move. Number 49. A pack of wolves in hunger enjoying their meal. That's a group you should never approach. Oh, really? What about a big boy who didn't get his morning treats and butt scratches? Now that's whom you should fear the most. Even wolves get their piece of anger management. Number 50. What's that color that's not black or white or gray and not a rainbow? Big boy color and a gorgeous one too. Number 51. Everyone needs a rest after a long day of being a good boy. I bet this one won't fall asleep in his working place no matter how hard he struggles. Duty first. Number 52. If there's a face that perfectly defines happiness, here it is. I'll never understand how these sea dogs can be so terrifyingly cute. Are there any haters left? If yes, do you even have hearts? Number 53. 
Oh man, we found him! The Arnold Schwarzenegger of the dog's world! He never missed his legs day, arms day, chest day, back day either. Seriously, what is his exercise plan? What's his diet? I need some advice from him. Number 54. This baby goes hard on such a huge dog. Even gives it a bite. But there's no fear in the room. It's full of loving and caring for each other creatures. A perfect family should look like this. Number 55. We all love to stroll around the neighborhood in the car, enjoying beautiful weather and sunshine. Enjoyment grows astronomically if it's barbecue season. Same experience for doggies and humans. Number 56. She's so young but already knows how to control big boys. At least we know there will always be guardian angels in her life throughout her teenage years. Her boyfriends will have a hard time if they'll even exist. Number 57. What can be better than a big chunk of a loving bulldog? Two of them. No fight for the good dog of the year here. Both deserve the title. Say what you want. No matter how frightening they look, these guys are perfect human friends and nannies for babies. Number 58. This good boy has been serving for almost 10 years. By the look in his eyes, you can see he's tired. But his belly says he never missed a lunch break. Everyone knows that a missed lunch is a minus to productivity. Number 59. This blonde asks if the doggy loves her, and it answers with a positive woo and a lick of the face. I'm not a dog language expert, but this sounds like a yes to me. Number 60. This woman isn't a dog language expert either. Poor Rottweiler was ashamed of her nasty tongue. Experts in the comments section, tell me, what did she say? Number 61. It probably takes a whole afternoon to scratch this doggy from butt to head. So what? Doggy loves it, and the owner too. It's a win-win situation, or scientifically speaking, a zero-sum game. Number 62. How many jars of milk does this doggy eat daily? I say not enough. Give it an extra. On the house. Number 63. Here are some snowy bunny hop skills from the local expert. Who knew big doggies and furry little rodents have so much in common? Number 64. Don't you hate that moment when your kid eats your sugar treats? Of course, I'm an adult, but who cares if we're talking about candies? Don't you grow up on me. Get your own treats, kiddo. Number 65. If you wonder what you can do with watermelon leftovers, here's the answer. Never throw them away. Better find that doggy and treat it right. We call it zero waste manufacturing. Number 66. Beauty and the Beast, all in one body. I'm glad we finally learned how to crossbreed dogs with horses. Number 67. This sleeping giant looks like he's been sleeping his whole life. But don't judge by the looks. He catches the ball with flying colors. One butt scratch gives him zoomies for five minutes. Number 68. What should you do if this fellow runs after you? Pray that you're not an intruder on his property and hope you still got that Twix bar in your pocket. Number 69. We finish with a perfect explanation of why people make big dogs to defend us against big eagles. Have you seen the size of this birdie and how Doggy defeated it in a fair fight? It definitely earned all its treats. And that's your lot for the world's biggest dogs. What breed did you find the cutest? Do you have any of them in your house? Please do share your experiences in the comment section below.